Hi, welcome to Motorhome Department. It's uh, Chris Blackwell taking you through yet another motorhome we got here for sale. This particular one is a Deflift Trend 6575 DBM. Bit of a mouthful actually. <laughs> 2016, it's got 14,000 miles over the, on the clock, well just short of 15 to be exact. Uh, as you can see it's an A-Class. It's actually plated at being three and a half ton, but uh, obviously I would suggest this can be uprated. See there's a diesel filler there, got uh, outside shower point and I forgot what the other one is now. <laughs> can't remember everything, do apologise. Water point, do apologise, can't remember everything. Uh, and then you've got a refillable gas uh, point there as well on this side, so that's quite rather good, better than changing bottles. In here, big garage, get lots in there. You've got tied on points as you can see. Uh, and the carpets we've rolled up, so obviously they're out of the way. Uh, you'll also notice just there as well, there's where the water heater is located. And obviously inside that little cubby hole there, you just can't quite see it. it's out of shot there. That's the uh, um, uh, release valve for obviously preventing frost damage. Anyway, shut this door. Or as I say, shut that door. <laughs> Around the back, you got uh, uh, reversing camera. You can see also you've got a detachable uh, tow bar and on this side you've got uh, barbecue gas point hookup toilet cassette you can see there and a fuel on Mr. Awning inside absolutely brilliant we love this van it's, it is fabulous um, it's a proper touring van it's a four berth van um, and you've got quite a nice lounge area but we'll come back to that in a second obviously got a kitchen on this side with a large fridge freezer there. And as you can see, there's also a television there. Down here uh, is a Thetford grill oven, which you can't really see, but it's down there. Uh, I can put these up. You can see you've got three burner hob and a sink. Plenty of storage up there too. And then in here, because it's an island bed, what you've got then is the ability to actually access it this way. There's some uh, drawer space down there. Um, or obviously from the outside. So just going to get my camera around to pop up and he can spin round. You can see you've got a his and her wardrobe on either side. Well, probably more hers than his. <laughs> so plenty of room for you. In the shower here, where you've got a separate shower, you've got this board that's been put into the ground, but obviously you take that up when you're using it to actually shut the doors properly to use the shower. And then there's uh, something that's been added on. It's a handrail then for hanging your towels to dry obviously. This door shuts across to give you in effect a bedroom and then obviously you've got your uh, uh, toilet and sink in there as well so quite good because you can actually yeah shut off the um, rear to the front if you know me. I don't know if there's a divider for this part as well. Um, no there isn't but at least it does become a separate bedroom. Couldn't show you in the shot just now because I was in the way, but then you can see this fridge, freezer. It's a full size one. You can see it's good size um, and that's rather good. So you've got plenty of space for your uh, ice cubes to make your gin and tonic. You do have one little awkward thing. You've got a step here, but just try and remember it. You get used to it eventually, but it's a step up into the social area. And here then we've got a nice little bench seat there two there two forward facing seat belts and this actually makes into an l-shaped lounge obviously this does slide along and move out around about and whatever so plenty of room for maneuverability and then in the front part of the cab you've got uh your uh aircon you've got uh, a cd player here as well so a pioneer set cruise control um and you're on a Fiat 2.3 chassis. It's got 14,000 miles on the clock as well, so that's quite good. Um, and then finally, we're not going to be able to do this properly because the seats are in the way right now because we'd have to spin the other way around. We just undo these clips here and you can see, well, this comes back down further when we drop the seats. You've got a massive bed up there. In fact, let's try and do that now while we're here. Um, Drop that one down like that, and drop that one down like that. There you go. Huge, absolutely fantastic. Uh, and you've got your ladder to get to it there. And obviously there's a net 
that you hang up on these points here to stop whoever falling out. It's a, a great van, actual fact. I, I like this, it's got a lot going for it. It's a Def Left Trend, a 6575 DBM, 2016, come and view it.